Welcome back dear viewers, thank you for joining today. We're going to be trying some twisting today, so there are, there's not much time left for this twist uh, season. So this is the first one, the very first one, which happens to have a rule set of only using cards, uh, class cards, and the sets available are from some, not, not too long ago, but includes a lot of sets that I think it's the first set with the Demon Hunter, the oldest one, I'm guessing. And let's see if we can get away with this deck. This is an all-in deck. Uh, the, that means I'm going after one particular winning combo. Uh, so it's all or nothing today. So let's see how it goes. Uh, didn't I just mulligan this one away? Uh, figures. Let's see, our opponent is a rogue, so rogues are not as scary as some other classes. Uh, but it is possible. So the twist, this twist rules means that um, the, there's a lot of consistency with the discovering effects and so on. So uh, it's kind of easy to blow up the opponent from hand, so that's what I'm going to try to do today. Uh, let's see, go with the flow. I think I want to draw. I uh, just want to find the pieces and complete my quest line as fast as possible. So we can assemble the finishing blow today. And I hope it's going to be spectacular. Draw first. Mordro, Ras, the, the namesake of the deck is this guy. So, uh, can the rogue stop me from completing my quest? Well, I don't want to see random secrets. <laughs> that's the way, that's the one thing I don't want to see. So, I can actually uh, complete my quest. My, my first stage of the quest and take down this guy during it. So let's take down this guy. We have a life till dude. Pretty good for me. I'm going to trade. And just before the opponent starts bouncing around this guy, we remove this and we draw. And I'm happy having this guy. is probably going to be destroyed by Tooth of Nefarian, something that deals 3 damage. Uh, I, I know the rogue has 3 damage, so he can equip weapon and take this guy out, but we don't worry too much about it. We need to play more overload cards. We only have one hand. Well, uh, this is an overload card, yes, but I'm not going to be able to play it just now. As a matter of fact, no, my combo, no, opponent. I had, I had uh, all the combo pieces in hand. Okay, one more time. That's what happens. Uh, I knew the rogue matchup is. Uh, rogues can do fine in this mode, but I think uh, some of the classes are a bit overpowered in this mode, and uh, some of them are underpowered. I think Shaman is in a sweet spot, uh, but it's not the strongest class. Let's see, a Mage. Mage is definitely the strongest class uh, because he has the Mage has access to Solid Alibi, which uh, for starters protects the the guys from one hit K KO, one hit combo, <laughs> one one turn knockouts. Um, and also the mages can freeze and um, of course basically they can play the entire deck for no cost so um, I'm going to be willing to draw first maybe maybe there's a better target for freezing something but who knows let's try to find more draw and also is getting ahead with the completion of the quest and we did find the far side which is excellent it's not included in my deck but it's a fine card to run 
the opponent wants to duplicate some nasty spell. I'm going to dredge. I could wait and dredge into my far side, but that's waiting too much. I want to move forward. Oh, I'm going to add both. Uh, now, this is a fantastic card in this mode because I know for sure there are only three options for this. Uh, oh, give me the ancestral knowledge. There are only three uh, spell damage minions that I can discover. One of them is the prime, one of them is overload, and the other one has plus two spell damage, but it starts dormant. So it's a pretty, pretty fine addition. So, what to do? Uh, I can draw, then I have one. This unlocks my overload. And of course, drawing is very good. Uh, let's, let's go ahead and we find this guy. It did not uh, unlock because <laughs> I, I did a, a mistake, but it did not unlock my thing, but we're fine. We now have one more mana to play around with. And we're going to discover... Well, I could play Lady Bash next turn or go just now with uh, the Novice Supper, which makes my my quest progress. And this is looking great. As long as we don't die instantly with the mage shenanigans. Let's see what she... Let's see what the mage is going to do to us. He decides to leave up my supper for some reason. I'm going to proceed with the cage mage custodian. This gives me the jazz band. This is a very nice addition. I'm going to deal some damage here. I'm not sure if I need to do this. Yeah, let's trade the guy, the little guy. Now, uh, the egg wing effect is scary for me because uh, if the opponent manages to get the spell damage, we are doomed. Uh oh, here it comes. Okay, that, that was a misplay. This should have been played before the other guy. Anyways. Let's see, I'm going to play this. Take down the boy. Go. Now, I should have drawn cards, but uh, it, it's fine. This weapon, when it is destroyed, makes our next spell cost less, according to the number of overload cards that we have played. I am not sure the opponent is figuring this correctly. I don't know what is he doing. Anyways, okay, it's scary. This guy has spell damage. He's going to copy a spell from the opponent's hand. We have to get rid of this guy. And we are going to do just that. We're going to discover some spell from our deck. We were very close to completing the quest line. Uh, how about getting this one? It doesn't matter, we're going to draw more. More cards, good. Very, 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 very good. Uh, now I just am so close to completing my quest and my combo is going to so I have only thing I, it's, I'm a bit overloaded here, but doesn't matter. And now the only thing now is, of course, for the opponent not conceding too soon. Okay, <laughs> this could be interesting. This makes my quest completed. I'm also going to be quite overloaded. Okay. I want to be able to play my guy right away. Uh, so you have to count. Uh, boy, 
I can also die if I don't react to the opponent's board. Uh, not sure. Let's let's go with the completion of our plan. It's going to be difficult. I'm going to drop this guy for sure. Now all my spells cast twice. Let's draw some Overlord card. Uh, if let's do this and uh, we are overloading like there's no tomorrow <laughs> I, am I able to play anything at all next turn? I don't think so uh, we look at these overloads oh the clocks only hope here to play some card is to draw overdraft from the top uh, other than that, I don't have any card available to play, but it doesn't matter. As long as I don't die instantly, I just want to survive for one more turn. Okay, I can live with that. Okay. Not even this. I could, I could for sure use my weapon here. It's not my plan. Huh. Okay, what do you guys think? I have 17 HP, but my combo requires for me not to attack this guy, which is sporting plus two spell damage. If I don't kill it, I die. If I kill it now, I lose my combo dream. Uh, I don't know what to do. I'm going to risk it. Anyways, this is the end. The game ends next turn, so let's see if the opponent can kill me, or if he can't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. More spell damage. Rewind. Okay, one mana left. Ow! Six damage to the face. Ouch. Okay. The combo is ready to go. Here goes. Ras. This guy is going to deal one damage to all enemies at the end of the turn. Improve die spell damage. So now we give this guy the spirit mount, providing plus spell damage plus one. But we are casting this twice. Now the guy has plus five spell damage. We attack. We break the weapon. Our next spells cost much less. We are going to copy this. Four times, twice, True and the turn, and 29, 29, 29, 29, 29, 29, 29, 29, 29. We just uh, went, uh, we went a little bit overboard with the combo, but well, that's, I'm happy because the opponent did not concede. And there we go. So I hope you have enjoyed and these uh, twist rules are going to end very soon so um, I hope we meet again soon with a new rule set. I'm going to be out of town for some time so I'm probably I'm going to skip making a video of the next one but maybe uh, I don't know how often the rules are going to change maybe each maybe once a week maybe once a month who knows well until then and the next video uh, please wait, stay tuned uh, for more content and sayonara.